make some sausage loaf or stuffed French bread. Stick around. Hey, this is Stacy from Let's Cook Y'all. Welcome back to our channel. Today we've got a game day favorite, some football food or party food. This is what we call a sausage loaf. I think it's also called stuffed French bread. We're going to take a loaf of French bread, cut it off, mix up a mixture of some um, sausage that we're gonna brown and we're gonna add eggs and milk and cheese to it. Stuff it all back in there with breadcrumbs and bake it until it's hot and gooey. This is sausage loaf or stuffed French bread. I'm gonna start by browning your sausage. We use just a Jimmy Dean regular. Feel free to use spicy if you like it. While the sausage is browning, I'm gonna go ahead and prepare the French bread. We're going to slice the top off long ways and then dig out from the bottom piece to make a boat where we're gonna put the filling. Be sure and reserve the breadcrumbs that you pull out. You're gonna need them. The bread that I pulled out, I'm going to toast up. You can toast it in the oven. I'm gonna use my toaster oven. You could use a skillet, pretty much anything. We're just gonna make them a little crispy. They're gonna mix with the sausage, egg, and cheese and milk mixture and go in the hollowed out bread. I like to grate my own cheese. I use cheddar and Monterey Jack. Use any cheese you like. You can use the bagged, but I think it does a lot better when you shred your own. In a separate bowl, we're gonna mix up the filling, starting with the eggs. We're gonna beat the eggs. The original recipe says until foamy. I'm not too worried about that. Then we'll add the milk. We're gonna add the drained sausage. The breadcrumbs. Remember to toast the breadcrumbs. I did mine in my toaster oven. And about a third of the cheese. See how if I can get all this stuffed in there. We'll top with the cheese and the other half and wrap it up tightly in foil. Bake in a 300 degree oven for about 30 minutes. Either my loaf of French bread was small or I'm kind of convinced they don't make them as large as they used to because all my stuffing did not fit. Y'all, when I was filming this, I was so nervous. I was sure since it was so much stuffing, I wouldn't be able to get all of it in here on the first try. I figured I'd have to shoot this several times, but I was able to get it on the first try and I was very relieved. I think my loaf of French bread is a little smaller than it should have been. It's gonna be fun to cut this one. We're gonna stick it in the oven until it's all hot. Wrapping it well in foil helps clean up and it keeps the bread from over browning. I think I overstuffed it. It looks yummy. You, I don't think you can overstuff it. We overstuffed it, but it's gonna be a booger to cut, but it's gonna taste amazing. That looks good, doesn't it? It's pretty overstuffed. I probably should have left some of the filling that out. That's out. going in your mouth. <laughs> mm. We were gonna have it for some football food. It would be great for a Super Bowl party, a fun family night or get together. This is sausage loaf or stuffed French bread. Thanks so much for stopping by our channel, Let's Cook Y'all. I hope you'll like, comment, and subscribe if you hadn't already. Have a wonderful and blessed day, y'all. See you in the next video. I think you should rename it to like excellent stuff sausage loaf or whatever it's called. Delicious. What? Delicious. <laughs>